All right, welcome back to the channel. I am doing a solo series here with Value Turbo. Uh, this deck is rising in popularity again after RBET one of the new season. It got second place, and this was one that I just had, I think, in my uh, dueling book archives. So I like this deck a lot. Um, every time I play it, I feel like it wins really, really quickly and when it draws normal, and that is kind of absurd. It's just a deck of good cards when you look at it. It plays a lot of good cards. It just cuts the fat of... You know, like other decks that play Hamster and Raiko, they tend to be really slow, but this one capitalizes on that engine like no other, in my opinion. Um, the only thing that's comparable is probably Christia Sworn, but yeah, this deck, this deck is actually trying to kill you in the first like two turns, and it can do it too. It's very scary how fast this deck can be. Um, and it also can grind, which I like. It plays Kai's, Kai's is great. Uh, Soroko being just a normal summon 2000 monster is always good. Greffer and Armageddon Knight are absurd. I do want to, I low key want to fit a, um, a Necro Garden in here. So I was debating between Spirit Reaper and Necro Garden, but I really like Reaper. So I, I think I'm going to keep the Reaper, but I would love to get a copy of Necro Garden in the deck because I just feel like that utility is really, really nice. It's not necessary though, and that's kind of why it's not here. Uh, as for the side deck, I mean, there's just, these are just all standard side deck cards that you're used to seeing. Um, not much to say on that. Uh, the things that I might want to side deck... I was thinking about Mask of Restrict low-key, because this deck can get away with it really, really well, I feel like. And I think that at this point, Mask of Restrict is just kind of not played anymore. So the frog decks that are going around now they know that everyone's siding pulling a rug so they're trying to make themselves not as susceptible to pulling a rug i.e things like vanity's fiend and soul exchange and all that stuff and that can be disastrous so i i think that mask restrict might make a resurgence and i think that this is one of the decks that can actually side it but that's a conversation for another day let's just get into some games oh is there anything i want to change about this extra deck so we got Mistworm in there. Can I, can I really make Mistworm though? Like, not really. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put a Red Dragon Archfiend in here. Red Dragon was really good when I played against um, 10 Foot the other night in uh, Beast Modes tournament. So I'm gonna go with, I'm gonna go with Red Dragon Archfiend. Anyway, says default. Okay. So, vanish you, set you, set you, set you. So, it's awkward to have Gores with the Starlight Road. Um, but I'm not going to commit the Torrential Tribute because I feel like if Torrential's down, I will have no shot of summoning Gores anytime soon. Whereas, it's more reasonable that if I get like heavied here, uh, I can go Starlight Road and then Deep Prison will just trade with one monster. I should be fine. What is that? If this card destroys a monster with zero attack by battle, you can special summon that monster from the graveyard to your side of the field and face up defense. Okay, well, I think... I think we're just going to do the simple one, two. And two cards your opponent controls. Destroy all three targets. Okay, this says destroy, right?
All right, well, things got a little wild. I don't think you have Gores, obviously. Uh, yeah. Let's see that hand. All right. I don't even know what I'm playing against, if I'm being honest. Uh, I almost feel kind of bad. And he's running into like an S tier deck playing reptiles, I guess. I mean, I always find it funny like this when decks that are not meta do things like this, like when they're summoning Brio and stuff, it's kind of funny. It's like you went out of your way to make this not meta deck, and then at the end of the day, like look at what you're doing. You're just doing the meta things. It's like, oh, you're making a Brionic for way more Um, I don't really know what I don't really know what he's trying to do and I don't want to ruin my deck by like maybe these I don't even know if this is good I'm going to take these out the card's not good going second anyway uh yeah I'm I'm going to keep it simple. All right. A hand of big dudes, but one of my favorite plays, Dust Tornado with Gores. Love to see it. Okay, that's one too many Kai's. Uh, all right. So when I have a hand like this, I mean, you only have one play if I'm being honest, but uh, I don't want to do this. I think we just said dust and pass. Oh my God, it's fucking his dust. What are the odds? We're doing this. This is my greed island arc. Let the greed flow through me. I'll give it to you. You you know I have gores. You can feel it. And you're like, I don't want to play into it. And I respect that. And I don't mind waiting. Uh, yeah, we will 
definitely set this right though. Evil dragon and it's a reptile. Oh, you're right. I was about to say. I don't have so many fucking monsters in my hand. I'm low-key a little annoyed by that. <laughs> yep. Yeah, you're good, buddy. I'm so glad I did summon Armageddon Knight last turn, by the way. Like, Jesus. Just gonna go for Caius. Must be real. No, you can't do that. Yeah, that is not how that works. You cannot ask me for a target and then Yeah. So I'm going I'm gonna banish this. Bad impulse. out of impulse like okay that's not really my problem though uh do i feel like something might happen to my thing yeah i do i'm going to activate this let me see that hand let's get a little screenshot what you got you want a solemn net I guess Gabriel was like the best card in his deck. Okay.
Don't push it. Back devastation virus. Show hand. One, two, three. Looks like three darks to me. Uh, I want the token gone first. Let's get out of here. Hopefully we can play against not reptiles. All right, well, he can't be playing fluffles, so that's good. I feel like winning a die roll with this deck is so important. I've drawn a lore like every single game. Yeah, see, imagine I went first. Like, look at look at my setup if I went first. About the set hamster set solemn set dust tornado pass. That's what I'm doing. I'm just doing it. I'll solemn right go right now. I'm in that kind of mood. I'm just in that kind of mood. I, <laughs> that is an interesting, like, 
first message to say to someone, my friend saw you at the PS5 tournament. I watch you on YouTube. You have helped me a lot. Thank you. Happy to have helped. Yeah, see, I like when people are really polite. I will say the first message is just, you know. <laughs> but yeah, I don't I don't mind. Oh, Black Wings, dear God. All right. Or not. Tributes for Sirocco. I mean, yes, like I was never, ever doing anything about that. Okay, so that that is likely he set the new one. Okay, he did not set a new one. Okay, so that's just fucking Icarus attack. I'm gonna have to solemn that. He's gonna target both of my back row. Oof. I did not. See, when Black Wings open kinda shit, like set value, set Icarus pass, it. It's really awkward. I think I still, my line of play is still the same. So flip. Declare effect target back row. Okay. Slash L3. Okay. All right, we're doing good. We're doing well. Uh, oh, I definitely don't think you play Gore, so. Okay, well. Hmm. I wonder if I should have set Torrential. What could he do that would make me Torrential right here? Summon Greffer. Okay, yep, Summon's good. I probably shouldn't let this go if I'm being honest. Like I probably should just solve McGrapher and call it a day. Because only bad things can come from this. came from this Greffer. <laughs> Ugh, it's kind of unreal. It's so funny because if I said Torrential, I just OD on him. All right, well, that was definitely a misplay because I have the Solemn. This is something that he could do that would make me use Torrential. It's kind of funny. And I asked a question and it got answered immediately. So definitely a misplay because I'm going to Solemn like a Heavy Storm anyway. I'm going to Solemn like a dark arm summon or whatever. And I probably need Torrential to back me up here. 
Also, like this. This play where my opponent is just like aping out on me. Okay, well, that guy is getting the ultimate the prison. We will deal with this thing, though. Oh, that was brutal. That was brutal. Okay, but it's awkward. Because then he gets to make a guy and attack over. Hmm. So I could just go set Reaper pass. If I go pump, I do 2,000 and drops from the 24. Actually, I think I, I think I kill him this way. So I go pump, attack, you take 24, or you take 2,000 rather. You go down to 26. He goes draw, make armor master, attack over your guy. He, whatever he stacked, he's going to draw again. So nothing kills me from this position. I'm also going to set torrential this time. Um, and then next turn, I can just go banish value, banish Sirocco, summon my guy. Tribute for Caius, and then I think the game should be over from there. So, yeah, let's do that. now I just realized I don't even have to let him summon a monster and attack over my guy um that's an annoying normal summon does that stop me from winning the game though so he would do I mean, unless he has Burial as his fucking last card, I think I'm good. I'm gonna Solemn this. What is half of, I cannot. Oof. All right, we're getting our calculator app out. 2850, I was having a hard time. Um. Yeah, unless he has Burial, I win. Okay, that's when I. That's what I thought. Okay. Black wings. Black wings. that oh, what do I want to 
was uh, I could go like set plague. No, I. Ugh, that seems awful. No, I'm just gonna set this pass. I want to set MST if I'm being honest, because I don't want to get whirlwind. But black Mang's put so much stress on you. Oh. <laughs> okay, I did not see that coming. True nade plague. What is he playing? Oh. What the fuck is this? Sure. I'm gonna go to 3,100, is it? He is milling. The time of his life. Okay, I am I am just dead. That was so fucking unreal. I'm not putting in Diddy Crow. Also Dino on the other hand though, his duck seems very high roller. I don't even know if he played. I don't think that deck plays whirlwind. <laughs> I don't have enough tuners to capitalize. Yeah, we're just doing this. See your full six. Two crow bottomless.
Mills terrible. So, obviously, without brain control, this game is just over. Like, I don't even think much commentary needs to be said. I'll put him in a position where he has one out, I think. I, I really don't know what else he could have. Like, my setup is extremely strong, so as long as I don't get fucking sacked here, I just win. But. Okay, that's annoying. Sure. Your hand was bad. Okay, I I don't think you saw DD Crow. I don't like siding DD Crow. Okay. 